guys and girls, welcome back to my channel. So today, as you can tell by the title of this video, I'm doing my January and February favourites combined this month, which I'm so excited to do because I've got quite a lot here. That's why I didn't do a January one on its own because I feel like I didn't have, have enough for just one um, monthly favourite. So let's get right into it. I've got quite a lot of lingerie, I've got some makeup, I've got some hair products, so let's get right into it. So first off, I'm going to start off with hair because I only have one product this month and it is these bad boys right here. I have been loving these so much. I've actually got two packs of them. <laughs> I actually bought these with my lovely friend Jilly. Hello Jilly if you're watching, I know, I know you will be. Hi! Um, yeah, I bought these of her and they are one of the best rollers I've actually ever used. They're so good. I'm going to show you inside quickly. You get 12 rollers in here which is amazing. I have two packets because sometimes I want like a more tighter curl and it's just good to have two packets I feel anyway. But yeah, they come like this. They look like a little like a leopard or giraffe print which I think is so cute. And you just wrap them around your hair and then you tie, well not tie, you literally clip them in if I can do it now. There we go and they'll look like that in your hair and you can link them together so they don't fall out. These are amazing because they stay in really, really well. I just generally love them so much. And I had to get them from her, I'm so glad I did. They are really, really awesome. And I don't know if you guys can see the little book down here. They belong to the books that I've got. I think I'd hauled it a while back now. And it's the Vintage Hairstyling book. Amazing, so now I can do looks from that book as well. But with these packs, you do get, you get 12 rollers in here and you do get a little like, leaflet in them as well which is really really great in case you guys don't have the book it tells you ways to like put the rollers in how to look after them vintage curls there's so many things like you do and it tells you how to like put them back up afterwards using the iron there's so many things in this little leaflet as well that you can do with these rollers so I really really like them they've been keeping heat off my hair I don't dry my hair with a hair dryer anymore I don't um hardly well I hardly ever use curling tongs or straighteners anymore yeah I absolutely love these and I highly recommend them if I can find them online somewhere I will definitely leave a link down below if not just type in rocking rollers and they should come up so now moving on to some makeup I have been loving this mini palette by Zoeva and it's the matte voyager palette and I think it's such a cute palette this is the outer packaging. Look how cute it is. There we go. It's so cute. And it just pops out like this. And then it's got the cover. The only thing I don't like about this is that it doesn't have a mirror, in a mirror inside. Um, but the colours are really, really nice. As you guys can see, it can create like a really cool smoky eye with these. And I have used them quite a lot. I haven't got them on my eyes today. But I have been using them for a good couple of weeks now and I really really like it. They're not that long lasting but if you are going away for a weekend and you need to take something like this is a good palette to do that. And I love how it has all the palette names there as well as well as on the outer packaging on the back. Um, which I think is really really awesome. Absolutely love it. My favourite colours in here is the one that's called Cheap Bar which is the middle kind of brown colour. And I love the two lighter shades. They do like a really nice smoky eye. But if you wanted more colour in your smoky eye, these two, like the orangey and the orangey red, so, so, so good on the lid. Amazing. Absolutely love it. My next and last makeup product is by Besame. Besame is one of my favourite makeup brands at the moment. I absolutely love them. I actually bought this of my friend called Laura because um, she never used it and she asked me if I wanted it and I was like, hell yeah, because Besame is expensive and they mainly only sell in America but I know Voodoo Vixen, the brand here in the UK, do stock them but they don't stock everything and this is one of the colours they did not have that I wanted so I'm glad I bought it off her. <laughs> it was literally new, unused, so that's why I got it. I would not have bought it if I knew it was used because, you know, <laughs> makeup hygiene and stuff. But yeah, this is a replica shade of uh, colour from 1920. I love the little facts that they tell you when they recreate their makeup because it says that on the packaging there, if you guys can see. The packaging is absolutely stunning. Love it so much. And even like the packaging on the lipsticks itself, so, so gorgeous. Look how cute they are. And it says um, Besame on there as well here. And this is the colour, I'm actually wearing this colour on my lips today. It's like a pinky red. It looks a bit crazy because <laughs> obviously I've used it quite a lot. 
but I love the shape they come in as well. These are so stunning and the colour is amazing. I would swatch it for you but I don't really want makeup all over me. But it's literally on my lips today and that's all I've got on my lips. I absolutely love this colour, it's so stunning. And if you're wondering what the colour is, it's called Besame Red and it's in C208. Absolutely love this colour, it's one of my favourites. So now moving on to lingerie, which are my last things I'm going to show you. I have some things from what Katie did and I've got some things from Revival Lingerie as well, which I cannot wait to show you. So I'm going to start off with Revival Lingerie. I recently done a photo shoot which was Valentine's themed and I wore like a, their black kind of cherry print set, which is absolutely gorgeous. I loved it so much. It's one of my favourite sets from them. And I'm going to show you what they look like now. These are the knickers. Look how cute they are, they look massive actually. <laughs> but then I got them in a medium because I was scared that like a small would be too small because I like a bit of room and these are high waisted which I love because I got a little tummy, I'm not the skinniest person ever. I love to cover my little, my little tummy. Um, <laughs> but I really really like these because of the print is so stunning and you can see the quality of how good they are. Um, it's got their little um, Revival lingerie label there. Absolutely love these. And what I like about them as well it's sheer at the back so everyone can see my ass. <laughs> but I absolutely love these. I think they're really, really great quality and such good for shooting in. And that's the reason why I bought them. To shoot in and they made me feel great. I love doing the shoot in these. And I also got the matching bra as well, which I absolutely love. Let me just do up the back so I can show you it properly. This is the gorgeous bra. I absolutely love the kind of vintage style they go for. This one has no wiring in it which I like because sometimes with these bras I find can be <laughs> a bit restricting and I like to have bras that don't have wiring as much anymore like I'm going to be wearing this quite a lot because I feel like it kept my boobs up it felt didn't feel too tight it just felt just right and I have been wearing it quite a lot I think it's amazing and I wore this for the photo shoot as well you can just see the quality of it there it's amazing and the back is quite like sheer sides as you can see there, and then it's got just a normal bra, like claspy bits there. But I really like it. I like the thickness of the straps, and I like the band that goes underneath as well. I generally love their lingerie. I am getting a couple of more sets. They actually do this set in white as well. So if you are more into like a white cherry print, absolutely love this. So I definitely recommend. So shout out to Revival Lingerie because they do have some amazing bits. I'll link them down in the description bar down below as well. So the last lingerie brand I have been loving for the past two months has been what Katie did. Their lingerie is absolutely stunning and well worth the money may I say. So I have a waist cincher here that I bought and have been rocking. This is the waist cincher. It's like a little waspy. I can't remember what this one's called but I'll link it into you in the description below. Absolutely love it. Look how stunning the quality is. It's so gorgeous. Uh, I absolutely love it. As you can see where it has like this kind of grip in the middle. This is the bit that will sink you in once it's done up in the front. Absolutely love it. It gives me the most amazing silhouette ever. And it's so stunning. They come in black as well as this creamy white colour. So gorgeous. I do want to get the black one as well. I've been wearing this under a lot of uh, lingerie. Under a lot of like dresses and skirts and tops. And it really does cinch your waist in for by about at least 2 or 3 inches. It really does go like that and my waist is around a 27 at the moment so it is getting there so when I have this on it goes down to like a 25 maybe I don't know it does lose quite a lot of inches but it really does work and I absolutely love it so it's 35 pounds on what Katie did I'll link it down below for you guys because I think these are well worth it especially if you're not used to corsets or anything these are a great way to start um and I recommend them if you do want that like really vintage look they're so good and it is their stockings. This is what they come in. I haven't used this pair yet, but I wanted to show you what they come and look like in the packaging when you get them through the post. They come in this really cute packaging that says what Katie did at the top there. And um, yeah, and you can get them in two different sizes. You get small, medium, and medium to large. And it tells you what height and like, you know, the weight of it, that how you should fit them properly. So I got a, a small to medium, and they fit me really, really well, even though I have got quite chunky thighs. The quality of these are really, really great as well, but they are quite thin. Um, I've got two other colours here. I've got a red pair, which I have used, as you can see, and I've got a purple pair, which I have opened, but I have not used as of yet, which I cannot wait to use. And then I have these blue ones, which I cannot wait to wear as well. 
The reason why I like these is because the band at the top, I'm going to get one out of the red one and show you guys. Um, I have used these for a shoot, that's why they're <laughs> kind of wrapped up funny. The band here is so thick and you can tell the quality is amazing. Like I used to buy like so much of cheap, um, one just fell on the floor. I used to buy so many cheap stockings off of eBay and you can definitely feel the quality difference. It's just the actual um, sheer bit here um, of the nylon, that's the bit you need to try and be careful of so you don't rip it. And also in the feet as well, I actually did rip the other one of these on the toe, but because it's on the toe, um, I don't mind because no one's going to see it, especially for photo shoots. And the reason why I like these as well is because it's got like a red seam. How gorgeous are these? And all the colours have their own seams at the back, so if you have a red one it will be red, if you have purple it will be purple seam. So gorgeous, the quality are amazing. But I generally love them as well, they're really great for photo shoots, or even if you're just a colourful girl that wants to wear colourful stockings, definitely get on it because what Katie did stockings are like one of the best brands out there, I definitely think so anyway. So definitely check them out, I'll link them in the description bar down below. Absolutely love them, I have been rocking them so much for photo shoots recently. Absolutely love. Anyways guys and girls, that's it for today's video, hope you guys and girls really did enjoy it. If you did, please give it a big old thumbs up and don't forget to comment in the comments and subscribe. Only if you guys want to, and I shall see you all again very soon. Also remember to follow me on Instagram. My Instagram will be put on the screen here somewhere, and my link will be in the description bar as well. So don't forget to check me out as well on all my other social media websites. But yeah, anyway guys, I'm going to go, so remember to smile, stay positive, and have a very good day or night, wherever you are in the world, and I'll see you all again very soon. And bye!